some breaking news now. We're hearing reports of an Amtrak train on fire near First and Walker in Milwaukee. Julia Fellow is out there live for us right now. And that's right, Bridget and Vince, we're at First Street and East Mineral. If you zoom in, Jim Angeli, my photographer, will zoom in. This is where an Amtrak train, we're told that from a passenger, that an engine set on fire over the intercoms. They heard someone say, very in a calm voice, we had a slight engine fire. No one on board, as we know at this time, have been injured, but I'm told by one of the passengers this was a Amtrak train that just left Union Station at 1020 this morning, headed to Milwaukee. He says that he felt the train jolt slightly, and then it began to drift, and suddenly they started to smell some type of rubbery smoke. He said that he became worried as did others. They wanted to leave the emergency exit windows, but they said it would be a very long drop to the bottom. They waited for a little bit, and they were told to start walking to the back of the train. He said that's when he became nervous. That's when that announcement came, came over and said that there was a slight engine fire. There were some people when we first came on scene, this tape right in front of us wasn't even up at that time. People walking aimlessly, not knowing what was going on, where their bags were. The man who I spoke to works downtown Milwaukee, was helping an elderly woman who was walking around not knowing what to do. Then suddenly a fire lieutenant grabbed him from me during the interview and said that we he had to be interviewed. So there will be an investigation. We have Chopper 4 headed to the scene, so we'll get some aerial views. But at at this time, at First and Mineral is where we are. This is where the train has drifted and has come to a stop. It, we don't see any smoke. I didn't smell any smoke when I came here, so it looks like the fire is out. If we learn of any injuries or what happened, of course, it'll be a long investigation. You start thinking of that train derailment that just happened in Pennsylvania. So as soon as we learn more, we'll bring it back to you. All right, that's Julia Fellow reporting live for us on this breaking news there in uh, Third Ward area, Walker's Point, as that Amtrak train is uh, still sitting there. Yeah, and as, as I learned earlier today, there's black boxes on all of those trains. So as Julia mentioned, we're trills, still trying to figure out what exactly started that fire, but that will likely have recorded some inf information for investigators to look at. We'll take a break. We'll be back right after this.